guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Mooli and welcome to a very 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 special video of 2022 Oof, it's 2022 already and I feel like I am still on 2020 I don't know what's happening but you have to deal with it but the past few days were really really tough for me I will tell you why you have to tolerate me with this cracky voice throughout this video for which I apologize in advance a few days ago I have given a story over on my Instagram to pick up some topic to have a chat with you guys because I really wanted to have a chat with you guys over in my KFC video I have also shared that I really want to have a chat with you guys and this is the day I'm gonna share everything that I have in here I am gonna share every single thing that is bothering me right now as this video is already really really long without further ado let's get started and let's have some chat hey guys from the bare face again and it's been long since I have got ready and chatted with you through camera so we are gonna do that today and I'm really sorry for this cracked voice of course because I have been trying to film this video since a while now like it's been more than five days since I'm dealing with this like cracked voice and I was like no it's not happening I have to sit down I have to do a video on new year it's been long since I have filmed a video so I was like I was craving to make this video <laughs> to say the least so yeah we are gonna get ready and we have a lot of topics to talk about so I'm not gonna talk about the products today I'm not gonna talk about the techniques today we are gonna chat and I'm gonna show you what products that I'm using over on the screen okay so yeah let's start how are you guys how is your 2022 is going like are you happy have you decided what you want to do what is your resolution for this 2022 for me i'm thankful that i have survived 2020 and 2021 and thank you again we are back to square one 22 is gonna be a shit again it's so weird to say like 2020 2020 20, 20, 20, 22 okay 2022 but it's gonna take me a while to adjust to this 22 thing because every single time i'm saying i am just stuck with 2020 Are bhai, 2020 ke two i am forgetting that so pardon me i'm gonna take long time to say this 2022 i genuinely thought that 22 will be a better place to live and then again on the first january our government announced lockdown so it's like partial lockdown but still it's a lockdown and everything is like back to square one again but people are not maintaining all these things of course people are absolutely right in their place like reducing train won't help the situation because the people who are working still working like uh, from office they are not working from home they have to work up to 10 p.m. So the next day, they have decided to run the train up to 10 p.m. But still, there is like lockdown situation is happening. So basically, this thing happened during Christmas. So during Christmas, everyone was like partying and stuff. And everyone was like living their last days of life, which is so furious. Come to think of it, people just forgot about covid like crazily okay and it's not just about kolkata it's about like everywhere in india i don't know a lot about like world because i have stopped watching news you know Achha, khabar to mujhe kuch milti nahi hai. so i'm like i'm not gonna watch man whatever is happening happening like i am just not stepping out like i just cannot put my family into pressure or into such position where they have to face all this covid situation and all even i have done my kfc challenge which if you haven't seen i will link it up in the eye you can go ahead and check that one out because that one is like amazing but that kfc challenge i have done by sitting on my bed literally on my bed i did not step out so i was like whatever happens unless and until this situation is getting better i'm not gonna step out we were about to go for holiday for like seven days but we have cancelled those uh, flight bookings as well which is so pathetic after two years literally after two years i have booked a proper flight to have like a proper holiday but that also got cancelled up to or bhi ek variant a gaya hai, like ihu wow what's happening guys what's happening so yeah I don't have such resolution for 2022 I just want to leave man right now I'm just feeling like I just want to survive 22 again and I 
just want to be proud of myself that yay i have survived 22 yay by staying negative some of you wanted to know that how my youtube life is going on <laughs> very very good question like i am also really really interested to know how my youtube life is going because i have no idea how my youtube life is going some of you were also interested to know if my parents like my family members are supportive about this career or not i think i have mentioned it in my 10k subscriber special q and a video that my family members are not that much supportive as i am like an adult person they cannot decide everything for myself i have to decide what path i am going to be choosing what path is better for me which path i'm going to walk down and what i'm going to be doing in my life there's something that i have to decide by myself and i don't know but uh, it is what it is i just want to be on youtube after so long i have found something i'm really really passionate about and i really want to be on this platform what happened during first january i felt so down i was feeling like so down i was like i don't even know what i'm doing and why i'm doing being on this platform for 2 years i don't know how i feel about it initially i was like okay with it like okay whatever is happening happening we will grow nicely i am not complaining okay like 16000 is a huge number don't get me wrong 16000 is someone's dream a lot of people actually started with me and uh, i know them that they have shut down the channel the channel did not grow so they have chosen another path and some of them are still trying to reach at least uh, 1000 and stuff i know that it's a lot a lot literally a lot but i also sometimes feel like it is a little bit more you know i don't know if i am like being very greedy or something but next time whenever i see a dm or a comment from you guys i feel like okay it's happening slowly but it's happening so i'm really really happy about it as well so a lot of you were actually asking me about this recent reel sensation uh like all the trendy reels and stuff I am not really sure about it guys. I am going to be very honest with you guys. Like I can understand the mini vlogs and the transformation and all of these things, but what is the point of lip sync to a song for 15 seconds? I just don't get it. Don't get me wrong guys, it might be your favorite, but uh as I just wanted to have a chat with you guys, I don't find these videos really relevant, you know. So whenever I see people are lip syncing to a particular portion like 15 second portion i just keep it i don't like to see those videos i just don't like to have it like for a trend no it's not happening man i have tried to watch so many videos back in the day like uh, up till uh, like from 1 to 4th i was not doing anything i was lying on the bed because i was feeling so down and my health was not good at all my voice is still cracked so you can understand like i was having very high fever my mom knows it because i was completely unconscious about the whole thing that was happening in the world because i was so numb and unconscious i could not feel anything i wasn't even able to get up from the bed you know i had a collaboration so i cancelled it i just told them that i cannot do it and over on phone the boy actually told me that uh, i think you are not well so take care of yourself and all of that because i was literally coughing you know and it was so difficult for me to uh, deal with all these things so from 1 to 4th of january of 22 was trash so what i was saying that to make real which actually makes sense like quick transitions quick tutorials i really like to watch them in reels i just love 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 them some of the hacks like makeup hacks or any other hacks it just not have to be related to makeup you know it can be related to food um travel and mini vlogs as i have mentioned earlier and all of those but not lip syncing for 15 seconds please Speaking of which a lot of DMs I have received regarding my Instagram and if you haven't checked that you might not know but I have deleted a lot of post from my Instagram and you guys were you guys have my back okay I I always say this and I'm going to say it 
until the end of my life you know you guys have got my back you guys are the ogs you guys are the real ones so a lot of you were actually dm to me that what happened why did you delete a lot of posts so i literally had like 500 plus posts so actually what happened guys nothing serious okay so don't worry uh what i have done is i wasn't getting sleepy like literally when i'm not sleepy what i do i do a bunch of crazy things and this is one of them i have done this around 3 49 a.m i can exactly remember the time and it was 3 49 a.m i wasn't getting sleep and i wanted to have some sugary food like sweet food to distract myself from having sweet food i have opened instagram and i was going through my own profile you will be thinking like how much self-obsessed i am no guys it's like uh, after <laughs> i'm just recalling the thing that happened with me that's why i'm laughing so i was just going through like bunch of reels and ek time pe jake reels bhi khatam ho gaya. and i was refreshing it and it was giving me the same reels again and again and i was like mm. Real tab to khatam ho gaya. I'm gonna switch to my own tab now. So I switched to my own profile. Like real section se mein pura bahar chali gai. And I went to my own profile and I was going through my own video and own posts. And I suddenly did not like them. And I was like, why this trash I have posted? When did I post this trash? And I was randomly deleting all the posts some of the posts were actually some collaborations on the next morning i have realized that what did i do what did i do the companies are gonna sue me for that rubbishness that i have done on the other night but it is what it is <laughs> so that's why i have deleted like 25 or 30 posts you know like very randomly i have deleted all of them and then i don't know I don't know. I don't have a backup of that. I did not even post all of those in my YT Shorts uh, like playlist with sucks. I filmed them. I edited them. I posted them. That time I liked all of these. And at 3.49 a.m. I did not like any of them. So I apparently deleted one by one. As I karte karte, I have deleted almost 30 posts from my feed. So I'm really sorry for that. But there is nothing serious, okay, as I am mentioning again and again. There is nothing serious. I am completely fine. This is just something that I have done to shift my focus from some sweet crap that I was about to eat. Because Ratko, my sweet cravings, not even Ratko. Every single time my sweet cravings are like this high. So, yeah. So that's why I just try to avoid sweet things by doing all these creepy things. So a lot of you were actually actually a lot of you like a lot of you had the same type of like chat options regarding youtube growth like how i have grown and how i have come this far first of all i did not grow and i'm still not growing and i don't know anything about growing so please don't embarrass me by asking this question like i'm still having like 10 views like literally 10 views over a day and my subscribers are growing i know but i don't know you guys what's happening maybe there is not even any maybe you know occurs on my channel so i'm not really understanding how to grow and stuff but still i'm not gonna be doing some crappy things over on my channel to gain some subscribers i'm happy how i'm growing and i'm quite satisfied like the family that i have over on my channel like the youtube family is my biggest strength right now whenever i just feel a little bit demotivated whenever i feel a little bit like down what i do i go through my studio app and I just go through the comments, the subscriber numbers that I'm having every single day. Every single day new people are joining me. So for me, number never really mattered. If it mattered, I would have done some silly things over on my channel. But I have never done that. I have always tried to stick to my main stream, which is makeup. And also sometimes here and there I do vlogs with my friends. And also with my friends, I have started doing vlogs when I have hit like 12,000 subscribers. Before that, I never wanted to embarrass them because maybe I don't give a damn about numbers, but they do. And they might think that I'm not going to get views or something. So it is going to be like a little bit embarrassing for them as well to come to a very like small channel. Small channel. Still, we have a very good number of subscribers. At least I believe that I have a very good number of subscribers. 
and I love my family so much. I'm talking about YouTube family. I don't know guys, please don't ask me anything about grow because I am growing every single day. There is like no instant grow, you know. Like, I think with every channel it happens like for one particular video you get a lot of subscribers but it never happened with me like I am growing day by day so I am feeling like for a particular content I never got a lot of subscribers they are watching my videos day by day and then they are subscribing to my channel that's what my youtube algorithm says to me and that's what I can see on my youtube studio app as well so yeah uh, that's how my channel is growing so I feel rather than there is a lot of things that actually goes on you know behind this channel growing like someone actually subscribes to a person because of their content someone watches one of the video and then they decide to subscribe to that particular person sometimes it's just because of the content sometimes it's just because of the person honestly from my aspect what i have understood that my channel is growing by far very steadily and uh, people are watching new viewers are coming to my channel and they are watching my particular one video one or two video and then they are deciding to subscribe to my channel it's not that one of my video went like viral and uh, it reached to like three million people and then I have gained like 7,000 subscribers. It did not happen with me. I think in future if it happens, obviously we'll see. And uh, of course, I will let you know about that as well. I will celebrate that day, of course, after so long I have got something that I was dreaming for. Or something like that. I don't know. But it is what it is. So I'm happy. Pardon me for not having a good chat about this topic because i don't have a very very good knowledge to describe this thing to you guys and this is the brow that i'm going for nowadays it's like pushy model brows it's just so feathery and it's just so flattering as well i'm loving it loving it i have stopped uh, threading i'm just uh, plucking a little bit with my tweezer the bottom section and the upper section is just like i'm just shaving a little bit i'm not plucking so yeah this is like my bad brow. This is like my good brow. Mm -hmm. If you know, you know. So a lot of you were interested to know that if I have been friends with any of YouTubers. So I have a very like different answer for it in different phases. So I have been friends with some YouTuber before I was even a YouTuber, you know. So I was friend with some YouTuber. I became friend with some YouTubers who are really growing and who are still like on my stage like they also have like sort of 7000 and 8000 subscribers and also with some good youtubers i'm so happy but i don't look at them as my colleague or something i just look at them as my friend and as my familiar person because once i consider them as my co-worker what will happen things will become so competitive and things will become so so complex and i don't want any complexity all of them are like nine to five job holder like my real friends like the friends that i was grew up with the friends that i have from my college and school no one literally no one from this youtube world which is crazy and also some of you are asking me with the same question that if you are just starting your youtube channel will i help or not of course I will I will do it as much as I can do it I'm not expecting like cross promotion or anything I am not willing to collaborate or anything right now because I just want to grow like I'm growing so I don't think I will be going for cross promotion or anything but from my side whatever I can do let me know do DM me I will try to do that okay I actually helped one of my friend uh, who just has started YouTube. It was a mixed experience, I'm not gonna lie. I actually arranged a collaboration for him or her. I'm not gonna mention any name because I don't know who is watching my video. I did not even get a thanks. I mean, it's not that I am expecting a thanks or something. Thanks is kuch hoga nahi, but aap agar ek thanks puche bologe, to usse bhi kuch hoga nahi. If someone is helping you to grow or if someone is actually helping you to get some collaborations or something, tell them appreciate them they are doing this out of 
anything like without any profit or anything anything under the sun they just deserve a small thanks or appreciation you know it doesn't have to be like thank you all the time sometimes a little appreciation makes it feel much more better so a little bit appreciation does not hurt anyone but it spreads a lot of positivity towards people people are gonna forget every single thing but people are never gonna forget how you have treated them also don't forget to tell me how i can help you guys i'm a very very like small petty youtuber no one gives a damn if i'm alive or not so just don't uh, go ahead and you know expect massive things from my side because i do get collaborations for like once or twice in a month oh my gosh this feels so good you guys after so long i'm having an intense chat with you guys Oof, it feels so heartwarming guys i was just being very very disappointed down and right now i'm like oh i'm gonna create another content tomorrow you guys are amazing some of you were actually asking me about the web series that i'm currently binge watching uh i have been watching a lot of c dramas and hollywood you know that i love this stuff like k drama c dramas and hollywood stuff i actually watched like millions of christmas movies last christmas as i have mentioned in my previous vlog i did not enjoy last christmas that much because it was like a little bit emotional it was like a little bit uh goofy i don't know if it is the right term to explain the movie because i don't know it was like a little bit superstitious and stuff so yeah i did not enjoy that but i also have watched like city lights like in general i love lauren and josh so much like so freaking much uh they are married of course but i have watched their uh, movie roped and i fell in love with that i did not enjoy the movie as much as i enjoyed their chemistry like they have amazing chemistry of course they are married so yeah kind of have to be and their parents now as well but still, I just love Lauren and Josh all together so much. Josh is just so handsome, so, so, so manly. Love him. So that's what I have watched. Also, I have watched a C-drama called My Bargain Queen. I did not enjoy that. So immediately after watching that, I deleted that. I watched offline. Now I am rooting to watch Emily in Paris. I did not start watching that because i did not enjoy season one i don't know why but a lot of people actually told me that you will enjoy that because you will relate yourself to that and i was like what do you mean even what do you mean but um honestly i did not like that you know mm -mm. so yeah i don't know if i will be watching the emily in paris season two and even in emily in paris <sighs> don't even get me started a bts song is included ah why <laughs> why like their stardom is just getting so unfreaking believable i don't know but i have a feeling like they're gonna break every single guinness book record i don't know i don't know i'm not a bds fan please don't unsubscribe to me please don't i know a lot of you are girls like most of my subscribers are girls and <laughs> girls are literally obsessed like obsessed with bts but i am at that stage where i don't know i have tried to like bts but it's not really happening maybe in future i will let you know guys when i will become a bts army whatever but right now no again please don't unsubscribe to my channel please don't <laughs> after watching sex education i you know was like uh, I have to give a little bit of a break to Hollywood because uh, every time it was reminding me that Ruby deserves Otis and Otis doesn't deserve Ruby if you know you know that's why I was like no I will refrain from watching Hollywood for a bit I also watched the roasting episode of the Jonas Brothers I actually forgot to mention that on Netflix and oh my gosh how they even tolerated that it was savage okay and the Priyanka Chopra's part was like amazing amazing i don't know why but i'm just a little bit biased about priyanka chopra because i just love her sometimes she does make a little bit of controversial statement and stuff but majority of people love her because of her personality and so do i irrespective of everything i'm just too much biased to her let me put on this lipstick it's just too difficult to line and talk so i recommend that as well so yeah this is my complete look i am not gonna set this face with like a makeup fixer 
because I'm not stepping out. It's freaking 2.35 a.m. right now and I'm easily gonna rinse it off right after I am turning off this camera. So I'm not gonna set it out and yeah, I think this is it. I have done a very pretty like wearable look. The motif of making this video was not creating this look. I just wanted to have a good chat session with you guys. So I really enjoyed after so long I have been chatting with you guys through camera and this is my favorite thing to do and we have covered a lot of topics over on this video. So I'm really really happy how it actually turned out. This look the video, the conversation. I'm feeling so light right now because I have talked with you guys about so many things and I'm just feeling a little bit light. Like this is my favorite thing. I'm gonna come often to talk to you guys through camera and yeah, that's it for this video. I think it is a very long video so I'm not gonna drag this outro for a very long time. So I really hope you guys enjoyed it and all the products that I have used on today's video I will be linked down below in the description box along with my socials. In case you wanna check my socials out there, I'm very active over on my Instagram so do check it out. And if you are new to this channel, then do not forget to like, share and also subscribe to my channel. Please help me to grow and also hit the notification bell icon so whenever I will post new videos in future, you will get a notification of that and you will get to see the video first and hopefully i will see you guys on the next one till then i love you all so much so much stay happy stay beautiful take care bye